Hey guys, what's up? It's Apollo here. I hope you guys are doing well and welcome to Conqueror's Blade. So this video is sponsored by my.com. I want to give them a big thank you for supporting the channel and sponsoring this video. And this is really a win-win situation because this game I'm really into. Like I've been seeing gameplay of it for a while now and I've been wanting to play it for a while. So when they offered this opportunity, I was more than happy to, uh, to do it and show you guys. And I think you guys are going to really like it. If you've never heard of Conqueror's Blade, it's like a mix of Mountain Blade and Dynasty Warriors in a tiny bit of total war it's like a really cool combo and it comes together nicely it will uh the game is eventually going to be well when it's out it will be a free to play mmo currently it's it's doing a lot of testing so the gameplay you see here is the siege test extended game build uh, so they're mostly focusing on just the siege battles and trying to get the siege battles right and you know you know just testing the siege battles so even though it seems like it's all focused around siege battles, it's not. There's going to be a lot of different other game modes and features. You're just seeing a special build that's focusing, you know, the siege battles. So you're going to see a lot of siege battles in today's gameplay, which is great because I know you guys love siege battles. Who doesn't? Uh, so they are actually doing more tests, uh, more siege battle game build tests. Uh, in the future so the, what they do is they kind of have like these windows of time when you can get on and play on the servers and then they you know let you play for a while and then they you know shut them down and make any corrections or they add features or whatever so if you want access to the siege test extended build I think you can pay uh, I think I think the cheapest way to get in is about fifteen dollars through their website. So definitely, if you if you can't wait, you want to play the game, I highly recommend you check that out. And of course, it's it supports the the developers of the game. Uh, but they are um, doing a special giveaway. So they are uh, giving away some keys. Uh, the uh, the test the siege test extended game build keys and to enter into this giveaway you use the link down below in the video description and you simply sign up for conqueror's blade uh, 50 winners will be randomly selected and you will be contacted by through email by my.com and this giveaway lasts until november 19th so that's a little cool thing you should check out again guys Check out this game. I think you're going to really, really enjoy it. Uh, it's it's really addictive. I wanted to play more. I honestly did. But, of course, you know, the servers went down. So, I can't wait until they're up again. And I'm definitely going to be doing more, more gameplay in the future. But that's enough talking, guys. Let's get into this thing. Uh, first off, we're going to look at character creation. This is my character. I'm level 9. I'm like a halberd guy. I just had to go with the big, powerful weapon. I'm Pixie Poo. And I'm with Aust uh, Austar... Aust Aust Hold on, let me work this out. Austaria? Austria? It's not Austria. Austaria, or something like that. It's like the Western medieval nation. And I'll show you what I'm talking about. So if you go to new character, you, you can select def different regions. Uh, and now each re region has kind of like a different culture vibe going on. So this is Austaria. I think is that's how you pronounce it. This region right here is like the Western medieval. Uh, of course, I'm going to pick that. I think this is more like Middle Eastern. Uh, this is more like Chinese. And this might be like Japanese um, kind of style. So we're going to go ahead and just go with the medieval for now. And uh, yeah, let's start here. And I'm not going to create a character. I'm just going to show you how it's done and what you can do. So you can pick between male and female. There's a couple different classes between the two sexes, uh, but it's mostly the same. So let's check out male here. Uh, quickly click United States. This is where you can do um, different faces and stuff. It's very, uh, it's very like there's a lot of eastern style like hairdo and stuff i was hoping that they would have less pretty boy faces and more like like scarred manly man faces like they've seen some stuff so hopefully they add some more of that but even that like i couldn't really make me like they didn't have like long hair that i liked that wasn't like like this you know like you know like eastern or or whatever so anyways um but yeah you have a couple selections there and then here are the different uh, classes that you can take and they all play out differently so you got you know sword and shield pole arm spear nodachi nodachi a shortened sword bow musket you got a, you got a lot of different classes 
uh, that you can you can try out and I'm pretty sure like if you go you, it's basically showing like Chinese armor here but if you click on the Western style culture your armor will be different it's not like you're gonna end up looking like you know you're fighting with a bunch of like medieval knights and you're in like Chinese warrior garb it, like it's not it's not gonna be like that so you put your name there you can create it so yeah definitely try out uh, again, I think the the females have like a dual wielding assassin class that the males don't have uh, And I think they also have like a short bow class uh, But yeah, that's that's about it with the creator uh, character creation But we're gonna stick with mine and we are going to enter the city I'll show you the city around a little bit. And this is the city is kind of like where This is where you do quest and you can build armor and you can trade and you can duel other players also this is where the the part of the area of the game where you need to be to enter into the siege battles which i think you guys are most excited about the siege battles which we will get into almost instantly once we get into the city here okay so here's the city this is where you spawn and this is where you uh you can manage your your equipment and you can buy better equipment and like you know when you level up and stuff it's a pretty big town you can see it on the map right here um but yeah and this is where all the other players are this is where you can duel other players which i'll i'll show you what that's all about um so right now i've got pretty basic equipment this is like starting equipment uh i've done a lot of the tutorial quest uh which you'll see when you start your new character and you can see this is my my house i got a couple of my friends in here uh but i hope to see more more people requesting to join my house and we will be the most mighty house of them all but anyways guys are you ready to go into a siege battle i will explain everything there so let's go ahead and just join the queue and we will uh get into some glorious siege battles all right awesome here we go we only had about a wait a minute i think to get into this battle uh so we are actually going to be uh defending in this fight and you can see that I've got a couple different units here. This is like the starting units you get. Uh, so I'm actually going to add some levy spearmen. Now each unit has different abilities and there's different perks to them. For example, I've got, let's see, what are these guys? Let's, well, these are like the Kazakh soldiers. They're more aggressive. These shielded uh, soldiers are more defensive. And then you've got uh, levy spearmen who are, who are great at like, being defensive and also protecting you, uh, which I'll show you what I'm talking about. So we've also got items. You can buy items in town. You can also buy like um, cannons that you can bring and build on the battlefield and use them in different situations. But we're going to spawn at A. There we go. And start. Woo, just barely made it in time. Check this out. We got players from all around the world here. And we are level 9. So we're kind of middle of the pack. We're not going to be the weakest, but we're certainly not the strongest. And, uh, yeah, we're going to spawn near A. And you're about to see some pretty awesomeness. Everybody's loading in pretty quickly as well. Someone left the game. Now, that's not good. Now, I think defenders start off with one less player because they do have the advantage of defending. Uh, so that's always helpful. Um, I think they also, like, when you're attacking, you get a really cool trebuchet ability, which uh, I will show you. Hopefully, the next time we play the Siege, we will be attacking, uh, because attacking can be pretty challenging, and you really got to work together as a team, uh, which is another important thing, which I hope in the future they're going to have, like, clan battles or, like, house battles, which I think they are. You can even have house allies. I think you can have some pretty, I mean, I can imagine like organizing my house and having like sub commanders and just like organizing everything so we put up the best defense. So here we are guys on the battlefield. You can see my troops. I'm starting off with my Kazakh infantry. And if you look on the, uh, again, I'm going to spend this battle mostly explaining how most of this works. In the next siege battle, I'm going to focus on just, you know, winning it. Uh, but on the bottom here, uh, you can see we have different commands. We have defend X. It's a uh, bottom left. Defend X, follow C, V is attack. And that's kind of the simple orders you can give. So if we hit X, they take a more defensive stance. You can change your formation. So shield wall is great at holding yeah, against infantry. So form shield wall. So epic. And then you can do like column, which is like uh, against archers, which is really great. They take a defensive 
and they put the shields up. It's really cool. And then you can do dispersed, which I assume is good against also against archers, like running past them. But for now, we're going to keep them in dispersed. And oh, did they just knock down the wall? Good God. And then we got other players coming in. So it's actually form a shield wall quickly quickly for and he's doing a shield charge you can actually charge in uh using an ability with an aggressive unit like that it's like a shield charge uh, but anyways we're gonna dismount here and we're gonna check out some of my abilities so you can see on the bottom center i've got a couple attacking ability of course i've got the basic attack and here we have uh, other players so i'm gonna try to get into this fight and uh, do some damage. Now, they are wrecking me right now. So, I'm going to fall back to the safety of these uh, allied pikes. And try to... I'm going to press H to heal. Um, but, yeah, there we go. We killed a couple of them. But, yeah, they are going hard right in this breach point they took down in the, the siege fight. Which, unfortunately, I didn't even get to the walls yet. There we go. We crushed them, though. Let's... Oh, I'm really injured. Oh, God. Okay. I need to fall back here. I'm going to go ahead and get my horse. Get the heck out of here. And uh, try to move to safety. Someone's trying to kill me, though. And I think, m yeah, my units all died there. But they died for the greater good. I'm actually glad they died. Because now I can show you uh, how to get more units. So there are replenishment centers. Which you can go to to replenish your health. Also get new units. Now, you can only have three units you can bring in into one battle. So if we go to the quartermaster. Change unit. Let's go ahead and bring the spearman. And it's going to take a little while, obviously. So let's go and get these units. And uh, there they go. Sweet. Reinforcements have arrived. I'm going to go ahead and dismount and heal up a little bit. And uh, it's going to take about eight seconds here. I want to get up to those walls and show you what it looks like, obviously. I just didn't expect the enemy to push so hard like that. Now, the spearmen, you can see their abilities way... If you look bottom left, you see assemble and advance, protect... Swi uh, switch seal uh, shield excuse me so if you want your uh, your troops to switch like put the shields on their back I'm not sure why you'd want to do that I guess to be more aggressive you can by uh, hitting five uh, you can protect kind of like they they protect you but here we go here's the here's the uh, the great walls here and you can see you can you can actually uh, control some of the artillery which is awesome I'm gonna go ahead and tell my men uh, right now, if you have C, which means follow, they just follow you wherever. For now, I'm going to put them in a defensive position yes, and do shield wall. Also, let me show you what protect looks like. Ready? If you press uh, 2, they will go wherever you are and they will protect your life. Look at this. They will protect you. That's so awesome. And look at they'll even fall. Look at that. That's awesome. But I don't need that right now, so I'm going to put them back into shield wall. I'm going to go look at where the end. Oh, the enemy is... Is that the enemy scaling the walls? I'm going to run over. Just tell my men to follow me. Follow me, men. Let's get over here and support this battle. So, uh, the battles last. Uh, the, it varies how long these battles last. It starts off with 10 minutes, but if they don't capture any of the points, then uh, they just run out of time. If they do capture points, it gives them little time bonuses. It adds time so they can keep on capturing uh, to the basically to the keep, to the final capture point. Okay, now they're attacking over here. So good job with the pikes here. Well done. Keep telling these um, these spears to follow me. Now, I could have left the spears over to that wall and to defend that area. Actually, I probably should have. Uh, actually, those aren't archers. Those are swordsmen. Let's quickly set up a defense here. Quick, 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 quick. Get back, you, you heathen. There we go. Here comes my reinforcements. I'm going to go ahead and drop back here. Oh, no. What happened? So artillery, I think that was an artillery hit, but I need to quickly try to hold, but we got some reinforcements coming in. So it also kind of reminds me of Tiger Knight, if you remember that game. Um, but I kind of like this one a bit more because it seems a bit more epic and grand in scale. But my troops got wrecked by artillery, which is a real shame. Oh, there it is. It even hit me doing some heavy damage. So I've lost a lot of units early on in this battle. So I might want to play a little bit more conservative. And my god, I get hit with just some dead eye over there who hit me with the artillery. And that's going to be my first death. Oh, he's just, yeah. Artillery can be really brutal in this game. Uh, a, a good strategy is using your artillery to take out theirs. So I will certainly try to do that in the, uh, in the next battle. Or even in this battle, if I can get my hands on some artillery. Um, I think I'll just rush 
uh, the next battle to an artillery piece. So this is what happens when you die. Uh, we're down to our last unit. So we're going to click on our spear militia. Let's go ahead and add this item, which is a uh, healing spice, I think. It helps you heal fast if you get in a tricky situation. And we're going to go ahead and spawn. It looks like we're still holding on everywhere. So let's just spawn here and let's get back into this fight. Now, spear militia, they're pretty tough, but they're really slow moving. So um, you don't want to like jump straight into the fight and expect your troops to be right behind you when you have spear militia. So come on, guys. Yes, my lord. But it seems like they are having a... Uh-oh. Uh -oh. This is not good. It looks like they're... Oh, they're going for A, guys. Let me check it up here. Let me see if we're... We've got... Oh! Guys! All right. I'm going to dismount here. They're taking their time, though. All right. I need to form a shield wall. Form shield wall! But they're so far behind. Look at them. Yeah, we're... They're... Oh! Here's a... No. No. No, not today. Here we go, here we go, reinforcements. Oh, come on, hold them back. All right, and then we got friendlies coming in. I gotta watch my health here. I'm trying to use my special abilities. Oh no, we gotta watch our flank. What is this? Got someone with the Had Hadachi sword, I'm pretty sure. Oh, there we go, nice. We took out one of their heroes. Oh, my men are getting flanked. Gotta protect my flank. So I'm just spamming my basic attack, using my special abilities as much as possible. Oh, God. Where did these guys come from? Oh, no, they captured. How they got extended time. Oh, they captured A. Oh, crap. Okay, retreat. I've got to get out of here. All right, this is not good. Oh, no. Oh, I gotta jump out of there. All right, I'm gonna risk my horse's health that... My, oh, that almost killed my horse, but I need to get out of here. Unfortunately, I think all of my units are dead, and we are now having to fall back to C. Now, we still control B, but usually when you lose A in this settlement, B is really hard to hold on to. And I no longer have any more units. So you can see that you just can't be like the hero and just go reckless with your units. There's some games where I don't even lose one unit, and there's some games where I just lose them like this in a matter of minutes. There we go. Oh, my God. They wrecked that guy. Uh, so, yeah, we are now having to fall back. We lost A. Once you lose a, a, a place, you can't get it back. So now what I'm going to do is just try to support my team where I can. I'm also going to use my consumable. If you press G, that's how you use your consumable, and that's going to add some healing uh, to my to my guy, which is great. So they're forming a shield wall. I'm gonna try to help protect. No, oh, you back off. You back off. You're not taking this city. We got a beautiful babe over here with her gun and her skirt uniform. All right. I fight for her, Lady Liberty. All right, so I'm going to fall back here a little bit. Again, it, it gets pretty intense. Also, I'm not the highest. We got a level 15 in the mix over there, so i got to be careful. But I'm just trying. Oh, i got to heal. I've got to heal. I'm going to get behind these troops. It's just the enemy. You see the enemy archer players? They're just going after me. I'm going to try to fall back here. And just, oh my god, there's enemies everywhere. They're taking C. If you can look over there, they're taking C. This is not good. So I'm going to fall back to B, or the final. This is actually the final location. What, is someone? What is happening? All right. Yeah, enemies capturing point C. This is not good. Oh, I'm going to go over there and help. I think that's what I'm hearing. Oh, I'm coming, dude. I'll help you fight. Yeah, she's running now. Don't worry, I got your back. Princess, whatever. Alright, so let's set up here. We get a better view of the battle. I know I'm not exactly, uh... Char oh, this is good. We got forces coming in from the rear. Oh, oh, he left the game. It was like his units just disappeared. I'm gonna help out with this fight over here. I'm gonna heal a little bit first. As I am very injured. And you can see that players are starting to run out of units as well. So not only do you got to try to keep yourself alive, but also try to keep your units alive because it's really going to help you late game. 
Oh, this is suicide. I've got to get out of here. Falling back. Shield wall. That's so epic. Shield wall. Okay, I'm going to fall back over here. They're just, they're focusing me down with those archers. And it's better to try to stay alive as long as possible because uh, the more you die, the longer you have to wait to respawn. Uh, which is another tact, another thing you have to consider. But look at all the enemies. I mean, is this not epic? This is so cool. The amount of troops on the battlefield and the control over the troops and the strategy. Oh, this is it. Ow. I, there's fall damage, so there you go. But we got some pikes, we got some shields going into the fray. Yeah, you know, I was just too careless with my troops. It's unfortunate. You can also, I think you can choose not to go in with troops. And hang hang on to them for the end of the game. But they're gonna they're taking B right now, so that's gonna extend their time even more to like seven minutes. Yeah, there it is. So we have to now hold for seven minutes, which is gonna be a very challenging, challenging uh, challenge. Challenging challenge. Hold this line, man. I want to join, but I'm just so... Ah, whatever. Let's get into this fight. Oh, that's a level 15. Good God. I'm gonna... I'm gonna back my way out of there. I, again, it, it seems like I'm not doing much, but it's, it's better to be alive and put a pressure on them. I don't know. You know what? I'm so low health that I'm just gonna try to get into this fight. Unfortunately, I have not been able to kill anyone here. And there we go. I've been killed again, and I've got to wait an even longer time. So let's go ahead and spectate. We got Black Crest over here with her gun. Trying to Arcabusier or whatever. Probably slaughtering that. But now, there we go. We've got a lot of... We still have a lot of, a lot of archers, actually, which are pretty deadly when you're putting up a last stand like this. But we've got a lot of troops. It's not terrible. But everybody needs to rally to this flag. Here comes the charge. I just want to join into the fray. Help defend this base. We've got to hold for 5 minutes, 54 seconds. Uh, there's no way they can extend their time. I'm pretty sure there isn't a way. So this is what it's all going to come down to. Uh, let's go ahead and... I'm not going to add that item. I'm going to hold on to it. Let's just respawn as close as possible uh, can we respawn there there we go yeah perfect all right so let's go get to that flag and fight to the bitter end it's all come down to this tragic very tragic so you can see the battles are not super fast it's not like a, a 10 minute battle now sometimes it can be if it's very one-sided but the battles do tend to go on depending on how good of a fight you put up So I'm just kind of running in, trying to kill their units here. Using my abilities as much as I can. Now again, I'm no expert at this game. Uh, at this game, I'm, I, you know, I'm sure a lot of you people who uh, have already played the game a lot, probably watching this, think I suck right now, which I probably do suck. But you know, I'm having a lot of fun with this game. Okay, this guy needs to die. Oh, you need to die. Oh, he's so. Yes. Oh, I got, ah, uh, I thought I got the kill. No, dang it, the damn archers are ruthless. Damn. Uh, so now we gotta wait even longer. We got a, pretty much an entire minute. Our forces are trying to hold on here. We got, uh-oh, we got this guy with the red hair and a black beard. There you go, nice. So archers can be really, really uh, challenging to take on. The key with archers, of course, is closing in the gap. But this is not good. Look at all these archers over here. This is insane. They've got, even got some pikes. Archer, I can see being a pretty fun unit. Oh, look at the shieldtron over here. That's so sick. And he's using them as a shield. That's awesome. I'm really glad, too, that you can walk through the shields. Like your the, like the NPCs, basically. The, the AI units. Uh, because it would be so annoying to having to like wait and being stuck behind. Now, of course, enemy enemy soldiers you can't run through, but your own. Oh, nice little spear charge there. Unfortunately, this guy's probably gonna die. Uh, how much time? Oh, oh, respawn. 
I'm gonna try to run in there and try to save this base. We got three minutes. If we can just hold on for three minutes, what's going on here? I might, I might help out in this battle. I do not respect the 1v1. He's gonna run. Get out of here. Which is, yes! Nice, all right, let's get on the horse again. We've got to desperately get over there. I'm gonna crush these archers. So you can fight on your horse. And it's actually good for moving through enemy forces. Oh, damn it. I got dismounted here. Oh my god, there's so many enemies. Uh, I'm getting focused. Oh, see, I couldn't roll through the enemy forces. We fight to the better end! Die! Oh, damn. Just too many of them. But I think this is going to be the end, guys. I don't think I'm going to be able to respawn here and try to fight and defend this area. But it was one hell of a battle. It is going to be a defeat. Hopefully, the next battle will be a uh, attack. If not, that's cool. We'll try to redeem ourselves and do another defense. But, yeah, let's, let's go. What is this person? They're healing up. There's really no point because they're about to win here. And There we go. So, that's the end of the fight, and you can see these battles are really, really intense. I'm almost at level 10, which is cool, because at level 10, I unlock some new armor, which I'm pretty excited about. Uh, but yeah, I killed 58 soldiers there. I <laughs> I lost a lot. Um, I died a lot. I assisted a lot. So, again, wasn't a great, great battle, but I was just trying to show off the skills and the abilities that you can do with different uh, different units. So uh, I'm just coming up with excuses basically. But in the next battle, I promise you, I will do better. All right, guys. So here we are back in the uh, the city. I am healing my troops. So at the end of every battle, if you lose troops, you have to heal them up, uh, and it does cost silver. So again, this is a free to play. So there's going to be mechanics like that. Uh, I'm sure when you get more elite troops, it's going to take even longer to heal, uh, which is going to be really interesting. But um, as we wait for that and we wait for um, another battle, I do want to show you dueling. So let me try to duel this person. If he didn't walk so weird, what the heck? Duel. Come on, duel me. Duel me. Let's see if he'll do it. Yes! Okay, cool. This is a great way to try, try out different units and stuff. He's a level 15, though, so he's going to kick my ass, but... You can try out different uh, skills, is what I meant to say. Come on. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Come on. You know, I feel like I'm not doing too bad against a level 15. I mean, look at his armor and stuff. Try to heal. Come on. Ah, just... Yeah, he got me. So, I mean, not bad. Not bad. I'm gonna go ahead and give him a... GG. <laughs> and there's your little duel. So that, that will help you work on, like, performing your skills and different combos and stuff. Now, if you want to actually look at your skills, you can see at the top of the screen, there's a whole kinds of different menus. So you can see your skills right here, all the different skills you can get, which is cool. Get some, uh, here's your mounts, your character, your inventory. So that's pretty cool. There's a lot of different stuff we can go through, but honestly, I just want to show you another uh, siege battle where I put up a much better defense. So let's go ahead and just jump into another battle and I'll meet you guys there. All right, here we go, and I am going to be able to redeem myself here uh, and defend this city. Uh, so I'm going to add the units I need. I'm going to go ahead and add uh, some items here. Or I think, again, let's actually, um, let's go to A and defend A area again. And I'm gonna rush to the walls as soon as possible and try to get on some of that artillery just to show you how that artillery works. Um, it's it's actually pretty cool. 
Uh, it's it's kind of like, you know, in Total War when you can like take over artillery during a battle. It's kind of like that. It's pretty sweet. Uh, but yeah, artillery is so, so important at just defenses and obviously taking out their artillery as well. But um, it's going to be pretty sweet. So here we go. Are you guys ready? <sighs> All right. We're not going to lose this time. I'm going to put up a much better defense and I'm going to be more careful with my soldiers. There's a lot of nuance to the game, I think, too. Uh, knowing when to charge in. No hey, d -Jack. You see the guy at the top there in the enemy team? D-Jack. That's uh, the guy I dueled. So not only did I duel him, I'm going to battle him. That's awesome. But yeah, I feel like there's a lot of nuance and a lot of like... You got to be very wise with your like situational type things. Like knowing when to go in, knowing when not to. Sometimes you just got to count on your teammates to support you. But, you know, you can't always do that. Alright, here we are. Okay, so... Three seconds, we're gonna rush up this wall. Let's go. Come on, Spearman. This way. I'm gonna try to quickly get on some artillery. And I'm gonna press B. Let's go ahead and get on the uh uh the ballista. Had a brain fart there. I'm like, what do you call this? So just press F and then you gotta line it up and you can see their artillery. Oh no! I was just about to fire. Are you kidding me? Alright, let's go over here real quick. Damn, some people are so accurate with it. You can see you can fire near oh, nearly hit theirs. Oh, I hit it. And if you press Z while you fire, um you can actually Oh. There we go. Hold on. All right. Pr sh fire at Z. Or is it Z? I'm pretty sure it was Z where you can like follow the shots. I did land a couple hits there, but like Total War, how you can follow the shots where it's going, um, you can do that there by pressing Z. Maybe it doesn't work with the ballista. I'm not really sure, but uh, let's see what's happening. It looks like they're attacking pretty hard over at B. A over here, uh, they don't seem to be attacking too hard. Oh, here we go. Oh, come on. I was just about to get on the artillery. All right. That's a cool artillery, although, like, they're shooting, like, arrows over there. It's really epic. Oh, yeah, they're pushing hard at B. Oh, jeez. Are we even holding B, guys? Look, they destroyed the walls over here. We do have a player over there. Mm, that's not good. That is not good. Oh, nice. That sea shard is getting close to being burnt down. I wish I had some artillery to support, but... Let's actually move my troops yes, sir. over to this side and help defend. You know, B might fall, but I'm responsible for A. It's not my problem, okay? And there's like no infantry. What the heck? All right, let's set up a line right here. Go! Fire, come on, man. Go, 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 go. Protect these archers. See, they're waiting for their troops to get on the siege tower. Can I get on this? Please say I can get on. <gasps> Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Okay, watch this. Ready? A Z while firing. Oh, dang it. I couldn't follow it because it hit the artillery or uh, the siege tower. Come on. You come up here. You're dead. You're dead. Oh, my God. This is... They, do they not see me? Okay, watch. Ready? When I fire, I'm going to go for the unit back here. Fire, print Z. Yeah, see that? It's pretty sweet. I was, sh I was short, though. Okay. And it, your units, in terms of siege equipment, your units do have to push them up. It's not like siege equip equipment magically uh, gets pushed up. You have to push it up. Oh, this guy's an idiot. Yeah, I'm going to kill your troops. I don't even care. Come on, quick, 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 quick. No! No! Damn it, I'm getting attacked. Alright. Oh, come on. I'm stuck. I'm getting... Oh, come on. I was stuck on the artillery. On my units. What happened to the archers? All the archers. I felt like I held that on my own. 
Uh, but we did get a kill, and we killed a ton of units there with that artillery. And you can just see how powerful artillery is. But again, guys, let's not get too crazy here. Um, losing units and such. Uh, we still are holding on to B, amazingly enough. They did not take B. They're actually taking A. Uh, but I think we're going to be able to take it back. Um, let's go ahead and go with the swordsman here. And I'm going to spawn at the same place. Or spawn right here, I guess. Um, this is not where I wanted to spawn. I should have clicked where I wanted to spawn. But let's try to get these uh, men back over to, day to A. That was my duty. My duty. And they are actually taking A. So we need to get units up there. Or are they? It, well, it looks... You can see it's starting to drain a little bit, but... Mid tower mounted, nice. There are towers on the walls you can set up on. Let's get these troops up here. My troops are so far behind. Let's go ahead and dismount. Wait for my troops a little bit. Make sure they get here safely. And uh, yeah, they do have an ability called, you can see it on the left, bottom left, shield rush. All you have to do is press um, one and they'll do it. Um, one thing to, to note when you're on the attacking side uh, to push, to use the equipment, you have to hit control. You know, I'm in the, you see how I've got this thing? And then you click on the, uh, the, uh, siege equipment and they'll go on and push it. Anyways, let's get out of that. And let's, uh, charge in my troops. Help defend here. The epic defense. They would not take a... Not on my watch. Ow. Guys, get in there. Oh, there's two versus one. And one's a level 15, and it's d -Jack, that bastard. Where was my team, though? Seriously, I don't want to be one of those people, but I thought there was a ton of soldiers near up. me. Defend. Hey. hey. Yeah, someone else was saying it, too. Oh, my God, they're flooding through that, that opening in the wall, and the gates are open as well. A is lost. We just have to cut our losses and... And fall back, which really sucks because if we could have just held on, all we had to do is hold on for about four minutes, less than four minutes. But I'm already down to my last unit, which really sucks. I'm gonna have to play super defensive here. I guess I'm just too aggressive. Maybe I need to get an archer unit in the mix because archer units seem pretty powerful. But yeah, I'm I'm down to the last unit. That's crazy. Oh, somebody's in their base. Look at that. Gee, they just died, I think, but. That was crazy. Let's go ahead and spawn there. Let's respawn. Here we go. Again, being defensive. I might even just hold back my units. I might just hold them in this, this passageway for now. And then maybe mobilize them when we need them most. So again, press X right here. Set up a shield wall. You can kind of turn it with A and D. We'll do that. Yes, my lord. Hold there, man. I'll call you up when I need you. But it looks like we kind of pushed them back. Again, using my troops defensively. Let's go ahead and dive into this battle. Ah! Ah! Your men will die. Again, killing their troops is important. Gets away, gets rid of their units. Look at, yes. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. I'm going to fall back here. Why do we have units in the back just sitting there? No, man. All right. Uh, a lot of lot of hero battles going on here. Oh, nice. Oh, someone set up artillery here. Okay, you know what that means? Okay, I'm going to help I'm going to help protect her. You know what? Get some troops over here. Yes, sir. Um, yes, my lord. Right there. I'm gonna help defend this artillery because this is really important. Now there is limited ammo. Okay. So this is like a crafted artillery. Nice. Now we could get outflanked over here. They can go around and flank us, but for now we're gonna. Yeah. See, it's out of ammo. That stinks. Well, why does it say reloading when it's out of ammo? Okay, so they're coming in. They got the shield wall there. Um, let's move my spears 
over here. Yes, sir. Come on, guys. Go, 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 go. These are pretty good spears. They're really good at holding the line. We defend, C. Oh, they're coming around this way now? Oh, what happened? Oh, God. My guys are getting wrecked. Oh, my God. Cav. Hold against the calf. Oh my God. All right, I'm going to fall back here. Try to heal up a little bit. I gotta help them. There we go. There we go. Now you get off your horse. Now the horse has health too. See? See how the horse died? Oh my god. This guy's not escaping. There we go. Damn it. I'm out of units again. Wow. They have, they have almost nine minutes to take this base now. God, there's no way. The only way we're going to beat them is if we can kill their units before they kill off ours. Oh, all right. There we go. Get these arch get archers up here. Got to try to heal as much as possible. Got some enemy forces there. Smart move. Oh, someone charging in. Don't do that. Get back here. Oh, nice. Some people have set up some some scorpions there. Go ahead and heal. Try to get as healthy as possible. Some units trying to flank around, which is smart. They can flank around here, which is unfortunate. Yep. Oh, they're going to capture... Well, no. Oh, God. Oh. They're coming. All right. We need units over here. Oh, it's D Jack. He's he's level fifteen. I'm I'm not fighting him. Nope, nope. Dude, can, why is everyone like come this way? There's, thank you. Oh God, here comes some cav. Trying to use my abilities here. There we go. That's why I like the big axes and pole arms, is that they do a lot of area of effect. Try to get rid of this calf. God, I, w I wish I just saved my spears. It always ends up like this. Okay, I'm just an idiot using my ability abilities, kill it. You know what? Get on my horse. You do a lot of damage on your horse. Oh, get get the hell out of there. Damn it, they killed my horse. Alright, we gotta fall back. We have to fall back. See, it's all about like teamwork that's why i really like this game too is like knowing when to fall back working together like it's there's a lot of nuance and strategy to the game but there's also at the same time a lot of like pvp combat which is really exciting here we go nice job archers oh god got archers flanking us josh i hope defend Oh god. Breaking units and ah I tried to to hold them back. I swear I've won many battles in this, alright? I don't think we're gonna win here. I don't even think I'm gonna be able to respawn. Unless somebody can get more troops up there. Yeah, come on, charge your men in. Charge your men. 
There you go. Okay, 40 seconds. This guy's a level 9 like me. He's doing the best he can. He's doing a lot of work over here in the back of this line. Oh, you can kill him. He's a level 5. Well, that guy's a level 15. Now. Yeah. He's down. Down for the count. Oh, oh! The random soldier killed that guy. Whoa, that's a weird... There we go. Oh, we're we're taking back C. Looks like okay. I'm gonna be able to respawn here at least one more time. We might just win it. There's a chance. Okay, so let's get that respawn. I right, got my other horse now. <laughs> Cause uh, pebbles died. This is now biscuits. Everybody should just be falling to, to see. Falling back to see. Fall back to see, guys. Fall back to see. Oop. We got. Oh. Looked like enemy was trying to flank us. More cav, damn. I would love to get some like Templar, you know? Can't wait for the late game. Seeing those badass units. Alright, I guess we should help. Oh, we outnumber them. Yes, I killed someone! Oh my god. I shouldn't act like I never kill anybody, but it has been a while. All right, I need to fall back, just like everyone else. Ooh, this is intense! All right, let's try to heal. All right. I also have my consumable. There we go, much faster. Oh, get out of here. Uh-uh, nope. Get on the horse, don't let him run. They're trying to heal. Oh, that was pretty smart. Good teamwork there. Oh, God. So, you saw his teammate protecting him as he was healing. Wish I had teammates like that. <laughs> no, my teammates are doing pretty good. Probably better than me. Alright, hold the line here. Get out of here. The horse is out of here. Ah! Ah! You will not break through! You will not! Oh, he's so close! Ah, oh, damn! Oh my god, I think everyone is just out of units. I now have to wait a, a, longer than a minute. So, when if I am able to, to respawn, the game's gonna be like seconds away from being over. But it's really coming down. I've never really seen this before, but it's coming down to PvP. Like, there's some units walking around, but it's mostly just heroes. Oh, D-Jack, you son of a gun. Oh, he's getting triple teamed. Oh, come on, get him! Oh, no, he's still alive! Kill him! Oh my god, he's still alive! My nemesis. 40 seconds. I don't think we're going to do it. I don't think we have enough. Oh, my God. No, get back in there, dude. You got to get back in there. Nope, they're about to cap. Go charge. Thank God. Oh, my God. He decapped him. Oh. But it's not going to be enough. Damn! Ah, I wish I didn't die there. But that was a great battle. You see how fun this game is. Again, guys, link down below. Use that link to enter into the get, uh, game giveaway. Or, or if you just want to buy the game and play it for the next test, um, server test, uh, be sure to do that. Join my 
uh, house, which I need to show you how to do. So let's do that now. Uh, let's just exit out of here. Alright guys, so once you're back in the town, you have to be at least level 5, which really doesn't take too long at all. Oh, there's d -Jack, that bastard. Anyways, so what you're going to do is go to press N, and this is the house stuff. You will see, um, you can't see, I think right here, no, join alliance. You're going to see, since I'm already in a house, you can't really see it, but you'll see join house. Make sure you type in knights of apollo just like this capital knights no space o for of and then apollo the capital a uh, then you got to spell it just right and then you will be able to join the epic house so that's gonna be it for me guys today thank you so much for watching again link down below just click on that uh and uh yeah i hope to see you guys on the battlefield thanks guys see you next time